it's late Thursday night. I thought I'd do a quick video. Uh, this one is um, just thinking about uh, it's a pretty bad week for 90s hip hop last week. Uh, we lose, lose, uh, we lost uh, Shabadoo. Uh, uh, he's more like a, a dancer, but he's still from the world of hip hop. Uh, Ecstasy from Houdini. They were pretty big back in the day. Uh, though some I think they were kind of a pop hip hop kind of a group, but respect they uh, they had a strong following. Made some good music, made some good songs. Uh, the one that really um, bugged me the most was uh, FM uh, or MF Doom. I was gonna call him FM Doom. <laughs> My dyslexia, man. MF Doom, um, who. Strangely enough, I just really got heavily into a couple of years ago. You know, I knew of him in the 90s. Uh, I wasn't, I wasn't a proud of the music scene enough to know that, that he was great. And I just started to appreciate the guy just recently. And now he's gone. That's too bad. Um, his story was really a, a, an interesting story. Uh, he was in... Uh, uh, KMD, I think was the name of the group, um, and uh, they were they had a couple of hits, uh, Gas Face, uh, uh, they did some some stuff with other with other people, and um, at some point, his brother, uh, Doom's brother, got killed in a, some kind of an accident, in a, a traffic accident or something like that. And at the same time, uh, the record company decided they were just going to drop him. So he just got screwed out of his record contract, and his brother was gone, and it was just a crushing defeat. And, it, and he just found himself homeless, uh, practically homeless for the most part, it was just a, a low point in his life. And he totally reinvented himself. He, uh, he modeled his new persona after he was inspired by the, the Dr. Doom, the, the Fantastic Four uh, villain, uh, MF Doom. And he, and it's, and it's, it's strange how there's parallels between him and Dr. Doom. Because um, Victor Von Doom, Dr. Doom, was, um, he was disfigured in an accident that uh, he blamed Reed Richards for. So, and he swore vengeance against Reed Richards and wore this iron mask to hide his, to hide his disfigurement. And, and the Doom character, the, the MF Doom character, wore the iron mask or the, the metallic mask to, I guess, maybe hide his scars, uh, his scars that were not so much physical but emotional. So there's, there's, there's some, uh, there's some really a lot of thought that went into that character, and you can hear the the pain in his rap and in his story and his you know in his words. Man, the guy, um, the guy was something else. He uh, made a lot of good stuff. Um, so rest in power, MF Doom, respect, man. Yesterday they said this crazy shit at the, at the nation's capital. Uh, these entitled people decided they're gonna just run up in the in the capital and and change the results of the of the election that they don't like. You know, this nation could use a lot more. It's more humility and a lot less entitlement. Uh, those people genuinely believe that it was that and and. It's just crazy. You look at their interview and some of them on the on the news, and they, they they sincerely are angry, and they are sincerely riled up. Of course, you know by Trump and all that, but uh, it, there's, there's a lot of twisted people out there. I mean, there's a lot of empty vessels looking to be filled. So it's it's it's, it's pretty crazy. Uh, and this is just and that's the thing that's going to last is that uh, you know that's going to be that's going to be around long after he's gone. Unfortunately, but uh, anyway, that's all that's going on this week. Uh, 
so far, in the morning I'm taking Yo-Yo to the vet. Uh, we get a, a liver test for him, and uh, hopefully things will turn out well with that. And we'll, at least we know what, uh, what we have to do for him. But that's it, that's all I got. Friday's coming up, Friday morning. So, see y'all later. <laughs>